Hey guys, welcome to the third Transfer Tuesday video for the month of April 2024. My name is Miranda and on this channel I share everything personal finance. I cover budgeting, saving and investing. If these topics are of interest to you, then please hit that like button, subscribe if you haven't already and let's get into today's video. So, last week I shared where I was with repaying um, some of my devices that I have including my iPhone 14 Pro Max as well as contributing towards my 100 envelope savings challenge which I am doing in hopes of saving 5050 which is part of my overall goal of saving and using 7500 for my travels so i shared an update on that last week and in today's video i'm gonna do the same i'm gonna give you an update on where i am with paying off this device as well as contributing to my um 100 envelope savings challenge and some of the money moves that i'm making um today i have made some money moves in the last three days on the device as well as on the 100 envelope savings challenge so without further ado let us begin so if you're new around here or are not familiar with what Transfer Tuesday is, Transfer Tuesday is a money movement that was started by Mary over at Pennies No Perfection here on YouTube with the idea being that we look for money within our budgets and send that towards our financial goals. A lot of us YouTubers in the finance space have uh, followed Mary along on this journey because it helps us to be consistent and accountable to one another and work towards our financial goals. I have been doing the Transfer Tuesdays for going on two three years now two and a half or three years and in that time i've saved over thirty thousand pounds and i have i definitely accredit having something as consistent as this movement to have helped me save that amount of money so starting off first i want to start off with the device payment because as part of my q2 2024 goals it's debt focused and i'm trying to pay off all of the unnecessary what i consider unnecessary expenses so that when we start q3 or the second half of the year i will be in a better position because my mortgage is coming off its lowest interest rate so right now i'm at 2.4 percent with my interest rate and we're coming off that so i'm gonna be moving from paying just under 900 pounds in terms of my mortgage to over 1300 yes it's a big jump which well there's really nothing much we can do because of the interest rates the interest rates now are good for savers but not so much for borrowers and i'm a borrower because obviously i've got mortgages so yeah that's why i'm trying to get rid of as much debt as i can and uh, obviously the device is one where money is taken out of my account every single month i would like to keep as much as i can because second half of the year a lot of it will be going um out of my account towards my mortgage so last week um i ended at 400 pounds left to pay off on this device and in the last three days i made a money movement and i sent um 50 pounds towards uh repaying this debt to bring me down to 350 pounds left to pay off this device so for today's video i'm just going to quickly take a screenshot of where i am now but for today's video i'm also planning to make another money movement for this and i'm going to make an extra repayment of about i want to say 25 pounds because i I think I can afford 25 pounds because at the moment I have barely touched my food budget for the month of April and we're already halfway through the month of April so I think I'm gonna be fine and I'm traveling as well in April so I don't think I'll need the entire amount this is why I'm comfortable with sending an additional 25 pounds towards paying off this device that would leave me with 325 pounds left to pay off by the time i am editing this video if i'm able to make an additional repayment i will and i will make sure i insert it in this video but if i do not then we will be ending this week at least for this transfer tuesday um at 325 pounds left to pay for this device so that is on the device i do have other devices that i'll also be paying off right now i'm just focusing on the iphone i don't know if i'll be able to pay this off this month especially as the other debt that i'm looking down because i do have my 
legend planner here so i'm looking at my q2 goals and one of them was to get rid of the clana debt for one of my devices so i paid off that device which was my ipad that's completely paid off at the time of filming this video so we've got nothing left there the next one i am working on religiously is the iphone and then when I'm done with that, I will be working on another device because I would like to pay that off as well. So for now, we, I have paid off the iPad and now I am working to pay off the iPhone as well. So I'm 325 pounds away from doing exactly that. That's it on the device. Now moving over up to my 100 envelope savings challenge so 100 envelope savings challenge equals once i've saved all of them it should equal to 5050 saved at the end of last week i ended at 300 pounds saved in total and then there was one pound 17 or thereabouts in the account um as interest because i keep the money that i'm saving in a high yield savings account so that's why there is a difference between where i actually am and what is showing up in my account so over the last couple of days i decided to add um 24 pounds to this pot um just to bring my total saved for this to 325 pounds and 17 pence so the one pound 17 like i said which is in the account is the interest my account earned so in actuality i have saved 300 and um 24 pounds for today's video i am going to do a live transfer for this one and i believe i wanted to um save envelope 17 yes i'll i'll make a note on the screen if it's the wrong envelope but i think it's envelope 17 so i'm gonna go ahead and do that so let's let the screen record now okay so you can see on the screen right now i added the 24 pounds a couple of days ago so i'm gonna add envelope 17 right now And with that, I am now at 341 pounds saved. But as you can see in the account, it's 342 and 17 pence. Again, one pound 17 is the interest this account earned. I am now at 6% saved um out of the 5050 that i am hoping to save for this challenge so that's where i am with the 100 envelope savings challenge and i keep it in my easy access savings cash icer which i'm absolutely loving but yeah so right now i have added 24 pounds and um 17 pounds towards this which in total this week i am adding that's three 44 pounds in total is what i'm adding to this envelope and i'm happy about that um so 341 pounds is where i am um at the moment with the challenge which is like i said six percent of the way there i have a goal to save 90 pounds this month hoping i can do that i think because we've still got two more transfer tuesdays i think i'll be able to save a little bit more than that but for now this is where we are and i'm happy about that because this money that i'm saving i am hoping to use this um for my uh travels and i do have like i said a trip this month but i don't think i'll be touching the envelope this month i have a trip next month but that's all expenses paid so i won't be touching that i don't think i'll cash flow things like parking at the airport and stuff like that and then the trip i have in june as well is also already paid for um so definitely don't know when i'll be able to touch this money but rest assured this money will be touched and will be used for my trips i may just end up reimbursing myself when i need to go into this um fund or just repurposing this money and moving it maybe to my emergency fund or other funds that i may be saving for but that is where i am right now with the 100 envelope savings challenge so with the device I have 325 pounds left to save um, to pay off and then with the 100 savings challenge I am now at 341 pounds saved oh my god I just realized I could if I wanted to use all of that money and pay off the device if I wanted to but I do not <laughs> 
if I wanted to. That's incredible. Okay, no, we're not going to do that, but it's a thought, isn't it? It really is a thought, but I'm not going to do that. I'll keep chipping away at the device slowly, but surely, but yeah. So that is the end of my Transfer Tuesday video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you guys in my next video.